right. Good evening, uh, War Room family. What I'm going to speak about has been bothering me for quite some time, as the other War Room generals know. Uh, Mr. Kevin Maurice Garnett is an NBA power forward who has been one of the top players in the NBA since he skipped college to come into the NBA in 1995. Now, don't get me wrong. I'm a KG fan, and I respect his all-around game and work ethic. The problem I have been having with Garnett is his propensity to yell, bark, scream, push, elbow, and talk an inordinate amount of trash to smaller players or players his size he thinks may be scared of him. There is actually a YouTube video out there that's titled KG, Kevin Garnett, the Vanilla Ice of Big Men. Go check it out. And it highlights KG barking at or pushing around point guards and shooting guards and those same guys getting right back in his face, actually, like Jose Calderon um, and Anthony Peeler. Then the video shows him getting elbowed in the mouth by former teammate Anthony Peeler, smacked in the back of the head by Portland Trailblazers <laughs> power forward LaMarcus Aldridge, and running away from Antonio McDice after a brief skirmish under the basket and getting stunned by Jason Maxill after Maxill blocked his shot, then fouled him, and then jumped up in the KG's face. And he was also thrown to the ground by Matt Bonner. And the video highlights KG being on the ground, getting up slowly. And then as soon as people start coming around him, then he wants to get tough and act like he wants to go get Matt Bonner. Now, he didn't play the, he didn't play the tough guy card in, in any of those instances. The most recent event happened – Last week, when five foot nine point guard for the Dallas Mavericks, J.J. Barea, fouled him, and KG tries to push him away with his elbow, and then you have the ref trying to talk to KG, and he is pushing the ref away too. Before that, a few weeks ago, you had KG hitting Channing Fry with, as Jimmy stated, a ha you get, and and him elbowing <coughs> Quentin Richardson in the playoffs last year after Paul Pierce over dramatically played out one of his injuries. Personally, I would like to see KG in the era with Barkley, Oakley, Rick Mahorn, Bill Lambeer, Maurice Lucas, and Kermit Washington and see if he would be acting this way. Now, I'm not one to condone, to condone violence, but I can imagine KG getting his chin personally checked by one of the aforementioned players. Now you have Joaquin Noah saying that KG is mean, and Charlie Villanueva saying KG talks a lot of crap. He's probably never been in a fight. I would love to get it in the ring with him. I will expose him. Now, me, all I have to say to KG is it's corny to try to bully and act tough towards certain people on the court and yet run away or back down when you think somebody might bring it to you. Just chill and play ball, fam. And with that, I throw a one-handed bounce pass to PJ. Yo, all I got to say to KG is you sissy. <laughs> but. Kuwait is the war room with five nights at the round table, five Philly guys diversified and educated.